welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do a quick look and a quick shout out to Crate Finds. Um, I know it hasn't been that long since I used their makeup, but I wanted to dip into some things I haven't played in in a while, namely this pink party glitter right here which is the only one I have they actually have a few other colors and several others coming in I haven't messed with this loose glitter in quite a while and the last time I did I got 18,000 views so I guess y'all liked it <laughs> so I thought I would play with it again and see what I could do and use a couple of colors that I hadn't really used in a little bit so and that is what we are doing today so today is going to be a quick voiceover tutorial I'm not going to talk to you while I do it but I'll stick the voiceover in and tell y'all what I'm going into and what I'm doing and all that good stuff. So I'm just going to show you how to do these eyes. Um, I have on some lashes that I think are already coming off because I suck at lashes. And I have on the Miss Murder Liquid Lip, which is my favorite. And I hadn't worn it in a while, so I thought why not go ahead and wear it today. So if y'all keep watching, you will get a look at which eyeshadows I used in this look. I know it's a little different, it's kind of random, but I wanted to try something that wasn't my usual, I guess. So that is it. It is time to start the video and quit rambling, and I will talk to y'all when I get done. Okay, so first I'm going to go into this shade, which is actually unreleased, but I'm just using it for a transition shade, so no big deal, but it is super gorgeous. Um, I use this to put it all over the crease just to build up kind of a light purpley vibe to get everything going, and I used a fluffy Morphe brush for this. I think it was the 441. Then I went into Penelope. That is a limited edition matte shadow. It is still available right now and should be super affordable. But I put that in the crease as well just to build up the darkness in the outer corner and to add a pop of blue in there. Then I took Red Queen, which is a shimmer and I put it all over the lid just with my finger. I wanted to combine some really different colors to get a really different kind of look and just see what would happen. So I applied it like that and if I look crazy like I'm talking to myself I promise I'm talking to everybody on the live I was doing while I filmed. <laughs> then I took some NYX glitter glue and I just applied that all over the lid because guess what's coming next after glitter glue. Then I took this little pot of pink party glitter. This also comes from Crate Finds. And I just used my finger and placed it everywhere where that glitter glue is. I did have a little bit of fallout, but it was nothing too crazy. And it definitely added to the look. This is also really cool on top of lipsticks too, but I didn't try that today. Then I went back into Red Queen with a small brush and used that to line my lower lash line. And I just wanted to do this to kind of tie the lower lash line and the lid together and be sure that red carried over. And then I went into that um, unreleased shade and I took it with a fluffier brush to blend out the Red Queen underneath my eye. And that completed the entire eye look, y'all. Okay, guys, so I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I had a lot of fun and actually had a lot of help. If you notice my mouth moving a lot, um, I went live in my Crate Bond squad and they helped me pick out my makeup for today and told me what to put together. So if it looks crazy, blame them. But I actually really like the way it turned out. I think it's very different and I could definitely see this like being, I don't know, kind of like a rocker vibe, maybe like a warp tour kind of thing. I don't know, in the sun all day that would get really, really hot with that glitter. But I definitely like it. It's definitely different and I'm totally glad I stepped out of the box a little bit and tried to put some colors together a little different than I normally would have. So that is it for today's video. I hope y'all enjoyed and I will see you in a couple of days. 
Bye, you guys.